Hello and welcome to another episode of Planet Base, Mars Colony 1. I am the Right Honourable Gentleman and in the last episode we were continuing to expand the colony, hoping that more colonists would be sent to us. Will we soon be sending them back to Earth and telling them to leave us alone? Keep watching to find out. So first of all we need probably some metal and some more bioplastic. These are working hard. Maybe we could trade for some. How much I? 54. Uh, maybe not. No. Thank you, but no, we will create our own. We are Mars Colony 1, we can build our own things. We just need some more metal. Okay, so we can hear, can hear in the background there's loads of meteors, which is quite um, unnerving, really. And this little guy here. So we, I think we're doing pretty well at the moment. We've got um, quite a self sufficient regime. We've got meals being created. And we have. Our sick bay, which is operating rather well, I think. And our factory, which is now going to create our first semiconductor when the engineer arrives. Eventually, maybe. We do need actually, that's the next thing that we need to look at, is that power supply. Because we're using critical power supply. Let's turn, I'm loath to turn it off. Because we're nearly at the end of that. And that's what happens. Okay, so we'll just have to wait. We'll make that our priority for the next thing. Um, yes, we know. Right. Uh, let's see. Because we, we are filling it, I guess. Um, so if we have a, maybe a wind turbine would, would assist. loads of um, I think what I will do is also another metal processor um, is something that we need I think for the time being we can probably look to Recycle that and take that back. We don't need that just yet. And likewise, we can take that off there. Good. 
Got to keep that power going. Got to keep that juice flowing. And the carrier bots are assisting with that. Where is our, our workers are in the mines? Our sleepy workers assisting there. Now we are looking a bit lower on meals. So I think that's because we're eating more. So let us create. Uh, we've got two lots of them. Um, let's have some lettuce. And what have we got there? We've got potato, wheat. How about some rice? That'll help us with that. Could do with another one of these carrier bots as well, so that would be helpful once that has been created. Our trading ship has arrived. Oh wow, okay. I don't think we need that. Dismiss. And our bots, so that one's very poor. Where's our engineer gone? I know he's floating about somewhere because he's been. There he is. Now, the reason the uh, ship's not taking off just yet is mainly because. There's a big sandstorm, as you can see. And uh, for those of you who might be interested in aviation when it's too windy or when it's sandstormed, it's quite difficult to maintain a uh, level playing field, certainly with a high wind. Now, that's being maintained. Where's... The bot is looking fine as well. This is why we need this power storage thing to be resolved quickly. Because it's starting to become quite irritating when uh, we run out. I think we're going to have to start turning bits off. Keeping that because we're doing fine for that. And then once that's got one piece, we'll be fine. I don't think we need a sick bay just yet. The lab doesn't need anything just yet. Come on, get this working. That or another power structure might be of some use. Uh, we've got a long time to wait here. I mean, the wind is fine as well, so it would be pretty good to keep that up. 
It's going to keep reminding me as well. So irritating. Let's raise that. Let's uh, put that on as well. And are we there? Six o'clock, day 14. And oh, there we go. It's going to turn around as it is, and we can finally get some daylight and some energy. <laughs> 